Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design a screw jack in Katia V5. On the right side you can see the completed design of the screw jack, all of the parts assembled together and on the left side you can see the different parts and the different dimension drawings which are required to complete the screw jack design. So in my last part of the tutorial I was designing the screw spindle which you can see on the right side of this drawing and uh, I'm going to take that drawing right here and continue the design. So over here we have the basic part being done except that we need to do a hole over here and a hole right here. So first one is a, a through hole so I'm going to select this face here this plane there and I'm going to give the sketch. So give the sketch and create a circle there and give a dimension for that circle must be a diameter of 12 and it is at a distance of 35 from this line there and you're gonna give the pocket up to next over here and up to next on the other option too and we got a through hole over there the next thing we need to do is uh, you know give a hole right here so select this face right here and click on the hole and now you need to see the different parameters which you have to insert in this uh, hole definition dialog box so the first thing we need to do is uh, set up the diameter the depth and the type so as you know that the type is countersunk select the countersunk and the depth go for angle and diameter so as you know the diameter is 12 just select 12 over here and leave the angle as the same right now just come over here zoom over here and as you know that uh, the depth the whole depth is uh, 35 so go for 35 here and go for a thread and select threaded and, and the thread depth is 30 which you can see over here and on the first one go for V button and just check whether you have all the dimensions right okay so this is 12 and everything is perfect so you can just uh, continue by clicking on preview and click on OK so we got that hole drilled over there and that's all our screw spindle design is complete and if you have any doubts or clarifications regarding this please comment below on my video and I'll be getting in touch with you and uh, if you have any CAD projects you can also write to me at katia.pro.user at gmail.com c-a-t-i-a dot p-r-o dot user at gmail.com and I'll be getting in touch with you as soon as I find time that's all for this particular part of the tutorial stay tuned for the next part thank you so much for watching